What's going on everybody? Thank you so much for joining me today. If you're new to the channel, uh, my name's Ian Schultz and today we're gonna do a little overview of my uh, Sony a7 III. So we're gonna just see on like how I set these up on how I run these on a uh, weekly basis for like YouTube and commercial work and photos. So the way you're seeing them right now is our photo uh, setup. Mackenzie, usually when we're doing a photo shoot, like a couple's photo shoot or something, she uses the 24 to 105 most of the time. Um, and uh, she has the battery grip on the bottom here. And I usually uh, get like the side angles and uh, just some other shots and stuff like that with the 50 millimeter F1.8, just no battery grip, just straight up camera. So that's kind of how we run our photo setups. And then I'll get into like how I run it for videos and commercials and stuff. All right, and this is how I have them set up for video. Uh, this is like my tripod setup, and this is kind of how I have it for YouTube as well. Uh, yeah, this is what I use for my A camera as like a tripod shot on my Manfrotto fluid head. And then I have my Zhiyun Weeble Lab. I usually have another lens on here. I'll have a, like a wide angle lens on here. I have a small rig cold shoe on the side here. I put my uh, Rode mic on there. It makes it just a lot easier for balancing and just the weight distribution, so. Um, yeah, I think it's pretty cool there. Sometimes I'll stick a monitor right here, but yeah, uh, I really like this setup. These are two of my just favorite go-to video setups. Uh, this one, I have a, it's a Gorilla uh, eye cup on here. I have a Ying Yong 4K monitor, I guess. It has a uh, focus peaking and uh, zebra and everything. So um, then I have an Atomos um, mini HDMI or micro HDMI or whatever it's called to a regular HDMI. Uh, and then I got my 24 to 105 lens. I got a Tackstar microphone on here, but I usually will put my Rode on there most of the time. Uh, I got a battery bank up here, and then it's also the small rig cage that's built for the battery grip, which I thought was really cool, and I had to pick it up. DSLR video shooter showed me that, and I fell in love ever since. Um, but yeah, I these are my two like I love these I love these setups. Uh, and I'm shooting on the A6300 right now. Kind of my go-tos to uh, for video. I really appreciate you guys stopping by. Thank you so much for watching. And a uh, little announcement: I'm gonna be trying to post a video every Monday. It's gonna be I think it's gonna be I'm coming up with a name for it. Uh, it's gonna be coffee and cameras. And I'm gonna just talk about like the latest camera equipment, just different things like that. Let me know if that's something you're interested in uh, and come up with a name for this everyday Monday thing. Uh, I'm interested, like, so come up with a name and if you come up with a name, I'll shout you out and uh, yeah, we'll see how this goes. <laughs> Thanks guys, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.